This is the Wheels and Smoke Arena on the outskirts of Johannesburg. No prizes for guessing why it's called that. Engines roar and tyres squeal as South African drivers drift or spin round corners, to the delight of the crowd. On the sidelines waits 15-year-old Mzwake Gwenya. He's here to show that you don't need four wheels to pull off some tricks. I'm happy that we are now spinning in front of a crowd. We don't only spin in our township anymore, but we can now be seen by other people. The monthly revved up Sunday event is usually reserved for cars, but it's just added a stunt bike exhibition for younger participants to show off their skills. Spared Lovu is one of the more seasoned drivers. I'm really impressed by what I see. This is where I also started because I had a love for BMW cars as a kid. At that age, I didn't have access to a car, but if they have passion, they will also make it one day. Drifting or spinning is a technique where the back tires lose traction as momentum propels a vehicle around a corner. Mgwenya practices with his friends in a township in Johannesburg's east. He's part of a club that encourages boys to fix up old bikes and learn tricks. The aim is to keep them away from crime and gangs. What I love about spinning bikes is that when we are bored and not doing anything, we don't get into trouble. But we spin and I love that it makes me happy. Gwenya's club, the 7K Stunt Bicycle Foundation, started during the global health crisis. At the time, exercise was one of the only reasons people were allowed to leave their homes. For Gwenya, it's become a passion. The teenager saved up three months of school spending money, a little over $140, to build his bike from spare parts. Now he dreams of heading for a bigger stage. One day he says he wants to race in the Tour de France.